Good morning guys. I am going to vlog this week. I have a ton of stuff that I have to do this week so I thought that this would be a good time to sort of test out doing a weekly vlog. When I did my purple hair transformation video a lot of you said that you would like to see more of my life so I want to test out doing that. I always think that I'm boring but then I sort of realized I enjoy watching some people that vlog and all they do is sort of chill around their house so some of you may enjoy that as well so that's what I'm going to do. Today Today is Monday and I'm going to show you what I make for breakfast. I have this for breakfast almost every single day. If you follow my second Instagram then you've seen this a ton of times but I'm going to just show you really quickly how I make it. So I usually saute up some mushrooms and then instead of eggs I eat this just egg. It is a egg substitute sort of thing that is made from mung beans but it tastes really really similar and it scrambles up exactly the same. So I will pour that in and then I will usually add some seasoning and then when I'm finished cooking that up I will add half of an avocado and this everything bagel seasoning. The seasoning is super super good. I get it at Trader Joe's and then I will always also have two strips of the Morning Star bacon and that is my breakfast almost every single day. <laughs> So since I don't have a bunch to do today, I think I'm going to show you guys all the updates I've done on my house. It's been a while since I've shown any of the decorations or any of the little additions that I've done to it. So I had my boyfriend put up these little shelves for me. I have my first real plant. It's this little succulent here. These shelves had to be more functional than decoration because I needed somewhere to put like our vitamins and stuff like that and before they were all just sitting here and that was really annoying to have a million things on the counter besides food and stuff like that and as you can see I already have enough stuff on here. So I just wanted something to have a tiny tiny bit more storage I guess. And by the way a lot of the stuff I'm going to show you guys today is from Amazon so I just will link that stuff like these shelves are. Next I put down this rug. Hey, Appa. I really really love this rug it's like one of my favorite pieces of the house now you do have to make sure to put one of those non-slip mats underneath though otherwise it will slide everywhere especially if you have dogs next I got this fake plant from home goods I decided I wanted to try to make the house feel a little bit more homey so I got a couple plants if you couldn't tell I want to grab a couple more and just spread them around the house but mainly it's this big one for now. I also have these little marble trays to put like random stuff in because I don't want it spread everywhere. I like it just like in those little trays. I also got this little fake succulent garden from Home Goods. I thought it was really cute because it is in a heart shape so like perfect for Valentine's Day or just year round if you have heart shaped stuff in your house. I have that one succulent but I just don't think I could take care of a bunch of plants so yeah it's fake. So it's a little bit of a mess right now but in my guest bedroom I added this little mirror. It looks like a mini Huvet mirror from Ikea but I got it from Target and then I added this little stool over here as well just to add something so that corner wasn't bare. So that's the update on the guest bedroom. I need to clean the guest bedroom because I have a friend actually coming in visiting me next week but here this is. We painted these cabinets in the guest bathroom as well as painted the mirror to go along with it. I'll put a before and after here on the screen. Then I don't know if I've ever shown this but this is a little moon mirror that I actually got at five below. Hi Persephone. Not sure if I've shown this but this is my bedroom. I put these little lights up because I don't know it just makes it feel a little bit more cozy. Then I believe that's it on the house updates. I am going to go film some stuff for Instagram and stuff and if I don't see you later for dinner or anything I will see you tomorrow. Just thought I would pop in with some makeup on because I feel like I've looked a mess for the whole beginning of this video but I just filmed so I thought I would say hey I need to go and take a shower now. I'm trying to wash out this color before my hair appointment on Friday because I want it to get back to blonde and so my best hope is to wash out as much of it as I can before then. That way they can do a bleach bath. So I need to be taking a shower and like shampooing my hair like four or five times a day. Not like a day but per shower. So I'm just going to go do that and I need to get back into my support bra. I actually take it off now to film just because I film for like 45 minutes an hour and I'm okay but I do have to 
basically wear it like 23 hours a day so it's nice when I cannot wear it for a couple minutes but I actually have my one month post-op that I'll be taking you guys with me on this week so I'm super super excited to get like the doctors okay to finally like take baths again and not have to wear this bra every second of my life that is one of the things I have coming up this week but I'm going to go try to wash out more of this color and I will see you guys later good morning guys so it is pretty early today is Tuesday I am in line to get my oil changed right now uh, I just took my boyfriend to work I'm gonna do this go to the post office and then I have a video to get up today and then I have to take my dog to get groomed so that's really it today i just have like a lot of little things to do as you can see i did manage to fade my hair pretty good from even just yesterday so i'm happy about that it's like a little bit more of a lavender now and less of like a big big purple less of a darker purple so i'll have to try to strip even a little bit more of it i'm going to i guess sit here for another 20 minutes until it's my turn and then i will catch up with you guys later time to get groomed I'm <gasps> grooming time so after i dropped my dog off to get groomed i went to nordstrom and i just went and tried on some stuff and it all looked really really bad um, I couldn't vlog in there because of the copyrighted music and stuff. And then I just went to this health food place kind of near my boyfriend's work so I'm waiting for him to get off. And I felt like really, really judged. It was like a way nicer place than I thought. It was like nicer than Whole Foods in there. But, and everyone in there was and just kind of staring at me with like looks and I don't know. I just feel like kind of like blah after going in there. I love going to health food and like specialty food stores to get like all the cool like little vegan products and like all the stuff that you usually can get at a normal grocery store. And I just wanted to browse, but I felt like every time I passed everyone, they were like judging me and I don't know. I'm gonna go pick up my boyfriend and then we'll go pick up Zoe from getting groomed. I'm sure she's gonna look super pretty. Yay, Zoe's pretty. So fluffy. Good morning guys. So today is Wednesday. I am on my way or almost to my one month post-op for my breast lift. So I am really excited. I just went to this like nutrition place and I got some of this flavor god seasoning. I've seen a lot of people tag me in these and I didn't want to like order online because I felt like, I don't know, I felt like I'd have to order a good amount of it just to make it worth it, because like, I don't know. But I found that there was a place around here that had them, so I went in and I was hoping to actually get their dessert ones, because they have ones like chocolate donut and stuff like that, and I was like, okay, that sounds cool, because I was wanting to flavor my overnight oats with them, because they don't really have much sugar or any sugar or something like that. And I was hoping that this place would have them, but they only had uh, like savory ones. So I got this ghost seasoning. So I'm hoping that it's good. I'm it's supposed to be really, really spicy. I guess we'll have to see. So yeah, I am going to go to my appointment now. It's in just like a couple minutes. I am wearing the same thing from yesterday because whatever, it's cold and I just wanna wear my big fluffy jacket, you know? So I'm going to go do that and I will let you guys know how it went afterwards. Okay, so my doctor said that I don't have to wear this stupid bra anymore. I am so excited, like beyond. Let me get in my car. I'm so excited. Okay, so I don't have to wear this um, support bra anymore. I am so happy about that. It had been sort of rubbing on my incisions and I feel like making it really uncomfortable. Um, I have to still wear something at night. They said I just want some sort of support at night, which is totally fine with me. But now during the day, I can wear whatever I want or nothing at all. I'm super excited. Um, I will make a Q&A video about this whole breast lift process and everything like that. Leave any questions you have down below and that's where I will get my questions from. I know a lot of the basic ones, you know, like, does it hurt? 
what's the healing like and stuff like that but anything else that i probably wouldn't think of totally leave down below and i will answer those in a video probably this month uh now that i can wear whatever so i'm super excited i am off to trader joe's now because i need to get more everything bagel seasoning so yeah off to do a little bit of grocery shopping and i'm gonna take this bra off though Woo. okay see you guys later so now i'm at hobby lobby looking for some fake plants potted plants and trees 50 percent off okay maybe a couple plants good afternoon guys today is thursday i really don't have anything to do today besides edit because i just filmed this look that'll be up on my instagram as usual but i just did want to pop in and not just like skip a day i figured i would show you where i put my new plant that i bought yesterday at hobby lobby so i put it here in this corner my tv and like ottoman and stuff like that all the dog toy <laughs> i need to get some moss or something to put over the top right here because i bought a pot to go with this because of the one that it was in it's not really like a pot it was more like a little container so i need to put something over the top but i think it looks good and this one looks a lot more real than my other one over there and i also bought this little hanging one i'm not sure where i want to put it yet though i was sort of thinking about putting it like right here but yeah we'll have to see about that good morning guys so i hadn't vlogged yet because i was rush but i am about to go get my hair done i am just going to get the roots and i'm going to ask if she can just do a like bleach bath on the rest of my hair to try to give it to a really really light purple or a really light pink depending whatever color my hair wants to go if it turns green so be it sometimes that can happen with purple um i just want it lighter so i can eventually put the new like arctic fox frosé on it that's what i want that's my goal but i am getting my hair done in nashville today i usually go down to huntsville to my normal hairstylist ariel but it's just too much for me right now to take the four hour round trip after my surgery it's just it's a long drive and i just can't be doing that every time every time i take that drive it just gets like harder and harder to take like a mini road trip every other month it just gets a lot so that's why i'm not going to her today i wish i could every single time if she was in nashville i absolutely would but just for like convenience and stuff like that i am going to someone here in nashville so i'll update you guys how it goes since this isn't like i'm not like familiar with this person i don't know how much i'll like vlog during it but I'll maybe i'll like get a couple like sneak peeks or something like that but i will see you guys in a bit with hopefully blonde blonde roots and light purple hair <laughs> Here is my outfit today. I just did something plain. I don't really like to wear nice clothes when I go get my hair done. Just a white sweater because I always get cold and then just this fluffy jacket, black jeans, and then just these black platforms. <laughs> okay so it came out way better than expected she was able to get it to like a nice icy blonde there's a couple small itty bitty spots of purple left but i'm super happy with it you guys know i wasn't even expecting to get to blonde today i was expecting to get to like a lavender she did the roots super well and it's like white practically so i'm really really happy i'm gonna go to the turnip truck now because i'm not always like downtown and so when i am down i like to go to like all the health food stores as i was telling you guys so okay why don't we do a little grocery haul got some cheddar puffs from vegan rob i got this vegan nacho cheese this is one of my favorites i got this sauce i like to use this as salad dressing i got some macadamia nut creamer because this is what my boyfriend likes and then last but not least i got just some daya cheese sauce this is good to dip vegetables in or just if you want to make some mac and cheese that's all i got i didn't get a ton of stuff it's just stuff that like i can't normally get at my normal grocery store all right and then now i'm gonna go film um it's only like oh my gosh it's like one so i'm gonna try to get in a instagram video then I'm gonna go pick up my boyfriend from work because I have the car today since I want to get my hair done. So I have to go pick him up. I'm pretty sure I've mentioned before that we share a car. So yeah, I'm gonna go do all of that and I will check in with you guys. Okay, so that is the end of this vlog. Please tell me if you guys liked it. I wouldn't mind doing a weekly vlog, but I don't want to bore anyone with my life. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to give this a like if you want some more. 
And I will hopefully see you guys next time. Bye.